Laser. What is a laser? Laser is a beam of light that many of us know virtually nothing of. We do not know much about its origin, inception, and applications. At the same time, laser has become an everyday part of our life. We encounter it more often than we realize. It may be in the form of a routine music playback, or at the movies, machining of various materials, at the dentist in modern medicine, at the laser light show, or as a school laser pointer. Although it was Albert Einstein who, at the beginning of the 20th century, laid down a theoretical basis for the laser, the first laser system was put into operation as late as in 1960 by an American physicist, Theodore Maimann. Four years later, the same model of the Ruby laser started operating at the Faculty of Nuclear and Physical Engineering in Prague, and the laser physics continue to be taught there ever since. The Czech Republic takes pride in its long tradition of using laser technologies that presently undergo a fundamental development. The Czech Republic has moved among the world leaders in the laser technology development now. Yes, you heard it right. A unique laser facility is to be built here. Extreme Light Infrastructure, or ELI for short, is an international project of a laser center with an output 1,000 times greater than that of one of the most efficient facilities in operation at present. ELI will help develop a new generation of laser technologies able to generate ultra-short pulses of great magnitude. Within one hundred thousandth of a billionth of a second, the beams will provide a hundred thousand times greater energy than what can be produced by all the power stations in the world. Or, if you'd like, Eli will be able to produce the same output that the sun would generate if it admitted all its energy from an area of the size of 10 by 10 centimeters. What can mankind use such power for? The interaction of the laser beam with matter with such high output will become a completely new phenomenon of great relevance for basic research. At the same time, it will enable a broad spectrum of applications with a high return for society in biochemistry, biology, physics, material engineering, nanotechnologies and medicine. Pro umístění centra Eli byla vybrána obec Dolní Břežany ve středočeském kraji. Several reasons were behind the choice why Dolní Břežany municipality within the central Bohemia region has been chosen as the most opportune location to build Eli in the Czech Republic. It was the fast connection with the Ruzinia airport, a direct access to the European highway network the vicinity of the capital city, Prague, the political, cultural and scientific centre of the Czech Republic. Additionally, the dynamic development of Dolny Drezhany now features a new housing development and a new shopping centre. And furthermore, the central Bohemian region is one of the most significant regions of the Czech Republic, from both the economic and cultural points of view. All of these aspects are of great importance for a European research facility. Eli is a very ambitious project. It represents a great challenge for both the science and the technology reaching far beyond the borders of one country. In 2007, the European Consortium for the Eli Preparatory Phase was established with over 40 research institutions from 13 European countries cooperating as partner organizations. The project's realization is welcomed by the Czech and the world scientific community. A consortium of 14 universities and scientific institutes, Eli CZ, supports the project in the Czech Republic. The project has received the full support of the Czech government and it is implemented with the financial support of the European Union. 
A unique laser center, the Eli Beamlines facility, will be built in our country. Its mission will focus on research in those fields of science that promise future potential, such as material research or medical diagnostics. Two additional Eli research facilities addressing other applications of laser research will be built in other locations in Europe. A complex laser system generating pulses of 20 femtoseconds, 20 times 10 to the minus 15th duration, will have become the backbone of the entire Eli Beamlines facility in the Czech Republic. A femtosecond pulse can be seen as a space length of 6 micrometers, whereas the length of one second pulse is 300,000 kilometers. It'll be the most intense laser in the world, with crucial importance to carry out further research activities. Because of Eli, it will become possible for us to understand different astrophysical phenomena, such as the radiation emitted by pulsars, or the behavior of matter in the cores of giant planets and brown dwarfs. The development of short wavelength radiation pulses and particle beams controlled by laser will bring a substantial improvement in some of the technologies used in medicine. These technologies will provide us with the possibility to achieve a high contrast imaging of material structure, molecules and live cells up until now unattainable. This progress in applications and technology development will contribute to a better understanding and a more effective treatment of complex illnesses such as, for example, cancer. It will be possible to develop targeted drugs and new technologies will become available for testing new materials, including nanomaterials. Eli presents the Czech Republic with a unique opportunity to become the world-class center of basic and applied research. It is now our turn to make the best of this opportunity and of this fantastic power. Eli laser made in the Czech Republic.